all right guys what's going on uh just wanted to give you a quick update on my b17 uh reveal 148 scale that i'm building for the hobby link international wings of world war ii group build uh speaking of hobby link international if you haven't been there you should go over there and check it out it's uh hobbylinkinternational.com uh great site run by a guy named kenny conklin he's a great guy set up a great community for all of us to hang out all of us modelers to hang out in you know uh, it's got everything from military models to sci-fi uh, figures busts 3d printed models it's it's all on there uh, you should go check it out hobbylinkinternational.com anyway uh this is my B-17 that I'm building for the Wings of World War II group build over there. And uh, I've been working on it during... We do a live stream every Sunday over on uh, Buckman's Model Mania website. Uh, I've been working on it every Sunday on the live stream. We didn't do a live stream this week, but uh, I just sat down during the time I would have been doing the live stream and worked on the b17 but uh there's the bombardier's room and the navigator got all that installed into the fuselage there is the cockpit with the gauges if i can get this in camera here there you go see the gauges and everything the seats the rear bulkhead there. And then there's the, the bomb area. I really don't even know why that's there. Because once the plane is sealed up, you'll never see that again. It'll be gone. But anyway, there's the, the radio operator's room. There's the rear bulkhead for that with all of his equipment. And then here's the back part of the plane. And then the tail gunner's area here. There's the back half of the gun with his little radio to communicate with everybody. But it's, it's coming along pretty nice. I also got the uh, machine gun installed here. And these little windows, all the windows are in. I still have to assemble this one and put the machine gun in it. But it's coming along. Uh, I've been thinking about lighting all of these lights the formation lights uh, along the spine here uh, the main light on top of the fuselage uh, the one on the bottom there's uh, three lights back here on the tail or two lights rather a, a white one and a red one back on the tail here um, I've been thinking about lighting all of those Here's the other side, what I've got done so far. It's coming along. I think I a little overdid the weathering on this side. I may have to back it off a little bit, but it's coming along pretty nice. Uh, but as I was saying, I was thinking about lighting all these. And uh, let me see here. On the wings. Right here, I think it is. There's a landing light on each wing that I'm going to light. Um, I believe there's some formation lights on the front of the tail planes there. And uh, let's see if I can find. Here it is. This is the piece that goes on the tail 
the machine gun goes right there and then one of these is white and one of these is red i think i'm going to light those too and then i'm also going to do the navigation lights on the end of the wings but uh just wanted to give you a quick update on my progress so far on the b17 so uh I guess that's about it for now. That's all I've got done. Um, like I said, if you get a chance, swing by uh, Hobby Link International. HobbyLinkInternational.com. It's a great little website. And uh, that's about all I have for tonight. So uh, have a good one. Take it easy. And I uh, hope to see you again here on Don's Modeling Bench with the next update for the B17. So have a good one.